And now to an update from ERCOT. The Electric Reliability Council of Texas is predicting record-breaking demand sometime this summer. And when there's record-breaking demand, Texans be yeah. getting nervous, right? KPRC 2's Andy Sirota is live in the newsroom. And Andy, ERCOT is confident about the grid going into the summer. Christine Daniela, they are with ERCOT predicting record-breaking demand sometime this summer. Utility regulators say the state's power grid is more reliable than it has ever been before pointing to more reserves and a combination of reforms that include conservative grid management. We feel very confident about the summer. In its seasonal assessment report, the Electric Reliability Council of Texas says it expects to have enough power to meet the peak demands during the upcoming summer season from June through September. ERCOT expects a summer peak demand of 77,000 megawatts and anticipates that there will be more than 91,000 megawatts of capacity available to cover that. But going into the summer, I want Texans to know that we will continue to operate with a margin of safety, meaning that we'll have more reserves than before. We're going to continue operating with an abundance of caution meaning that we'll bring more generators online sooner rather than later. Texas now requires the weatherization of power generation, natural gas and transmission facilities to handle extreme weather. The Texas Railroad Commission and ERCOT will be required to inspect them. Failure to weatherize these facilities could result in a penalty of up to $1 million. We're ensuring that ERCOT prioritizes those generators to make sure that the ones that run when we need them the most are in front of the line for maintenance outages. So all of our generator fleets are ready for uh, this coming summer. Utility regulators say record breaking demand with high temperatures last week was certainly a good test for them. They hope to deliver the results of phase two of their reforms to the governor and state lawmakers for their consideration before the next session starts. Live in the newsroom, Andy Sirota, KPRC 2 News.